Hi guys and welcome back to Fallout 76 or the Fallout 76 beta. My name is Digi and today I'll be pushing on from the first video. I'm still in the beta, still in the first run. Um, and I'm out exploring. I decided to follow this train track and uh, see where it leads. I seem to be in my group at least. My group in the people that all started at the same time as I did. I seem to be the most furthest to the south. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. You would also notice I found myself a paramedic um, thingy bob. Sweet. Costume, clothes. I, words are escaping me today. I'm not sure why. So, we're following along this train track. Pretty cool area. Not really encountering much. I have not seen. Oh, that was a bit of a splutter there. Kind of just froze up on me there for a second. Uh, I haven't seen any other, like, human players down here. Uh, is that one of the scorched? Yes, it is. Um, not seen here. Oh, radiation. Not seen human players. Not seen train station. Not really come across any enemies yet. What? No. No nukes. Blood pack 50. Radix. No stim packs, but stim packs are 100. I find. I just hope that as a level that um caps will become more and more plentiful because a hundred caps for a stim pack is a lot in this crazy economy i have i haven't even made my first hundred yet we have a little robot in there on the left and this would be where you purchase trade tickets but i'm guessing that's no longer a thing We don't even have wait times. All right. So there was a stash box there behind me. And out that side, there's not too much going on here either. What is this? Well, if nothing else, it's interesting. But... Okay. Phew. So I hit start for the map there. I thought the whole game was going to crash on me. Literally took, what, four to five seconds there to of, of total nothingness while I pulled the map on me. It's literally nothing. No one to shoot. No one to talk to. Nothing exciting to find yet. And, like, here's the thing that kills me the most. I know my time is limited because I'm on a beta. So, I feel like, you know, I should be accomplishing something. And <laughs> everywhere I go is just nothingness. Of course, it's a post-apocalyptic world, so that is how it's meant to be. I'm just more curious about things, you know, out to kill me. Things I'm going to kill people. It's a multiplayer game. But that's not there. Oh, Charleston, okay. In fairness, that's hardly their fault, because I'm the one who ventured away from the pack. Okay. Okay. Charlestown Herald. Now we're talk talking. Yes. Things are looking up. Combat in this game? <laughs> Very easy. At the moment. But, oh. Oh, hang on. Did you hear that? I think we're in luck. So we could take a gander up. Oh, I hear you. I hear you. There you are. We're in sneaky, sneaky mode. We haven't been seen yet, but clearly he knows something's up. Oh, he's got a gun. I wasn't expecting the gun. Die! Die! <laughs> I hear another one. I'm totally Brotherhood of Steel material, guys. <laughs> you can totally tell. Hello. You don't have a gun. That's refreshing. Oh, oh, I felt that. Oh, again! Whew, oh. 
please. There's a gunfight going on and I'm not involved. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because I know no one else is this far south. I'll let this play. Mothman. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright, what's this? So I think we'll play another one. I can hear that guy running around me. He's like it's irritating me. Oh there he is, he's found me. Bye. No, one more. Come on. Come on. Oh, health is a bad thing now. Health is a bad thing, and I brought this upon myself. Oh, we're still in danger. What the hell? What have I gotten myself into here? I could have approached this much better. Okay. Yum, yum. Take some chops. Oh, look at that. That's quite a... It's 90 mutton chops. Right, we're gonna play this one in hopefully relative safety here. I'm William Breyer, investigative reporter for the Charleston Herald. I'm currently standing just outside the security fencing of one of several horn ride industrial sites that have cropped up around the area in recent months. I'm here tonight to try and get some answers about what has become known in certain circles as the Mother Load Project. Could this be the answer local mining families have been looking for? A series of new mining projects that could reinvigorate the local economy. Or as the environmental groups have suggested, could these be a fresh set of toxic disposal sites poisoning the ground beneath our feet? At the very least, according to local experts, the area's recent increase in seismic events can almost certainly be tied to these sites. And now I'm here to see for myself what's really going on. I've just made my way up to a small gap in the first line of fencing. The security here is intense. Barbed wire, armed guards, feels like a war zone. I'm making my way over a small ridge and I... Mother of God! Ground shaking and... Oh my God. Why? Well, that escalated quickly. I'm gonna like it here. All right, straight away, you know what? Everything I said, forget it. I'm, I was saying there's not much going on. There is, and suddenly I find a building, and I just realized that for a second, I'd completely forgotten about this will to, to succeed and to, to make progress during the beta. It's like, I just wanna know more about what's going on here. Oh, okay, Hornwright Industrial Headquarters.
So we're a little bit irradiated. Oh, that's not helping. Health is good. There's a bed there. Oh, I didn't do that. That was not me. Alright, we're hidden. I'm gonna play this sneaky sneaky. I don't wanna be losing health unnecessarily again. Got some ammo there, that's nice. I got a duffel bag. And we have a cooking stove. I think we're good. I think we're safe to have a look. Ooh, hello. Got a nice little recipe there. Don't mind if I do. We'll grab that bottle for no other reason than it's there and we have room for it. I'll give some soup. Nothing on healing. Loads of plant things we can do. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, it's quiet down here as well. Uh, at least that's my first impression. Kind of looking for another tape or another piece to a story. I hear you. I just... Oh. There you are. You've been making me nervous. So that just had to be done. Oh, damn it. We're in danger. He wasn't alone. Oh, we got a shooter. We got a shooter. Where are you? Well, that's not you. It's not you. Not to worry. It's not immediately visible. I'm not too worried about it. I guess that's the important lesson. Whoa, wait. Hang on. Well, hello. Inside. Inside. Us. us. Inside us. Some bobby pens. Lovely. And... Damn radiation. Damn it. There's a live one down there, right? Or else what? Okay, caution. There you are. Whoa, whoa. Oh, that was brutal. Just charge him, just charge him. Come on. Yes, yes. Die. I have to get used to the third person perspective when I'm firing my gun. I'm so used to first person, but I quite enjoy playing this in third. It hurts me as a result though, clearly. Oh. It's a miss. Pop. Oh, that's a challenge complete right there. And 20, 20 atoms. They're clocking in nicely. Not much I can do with them, but they're clocking in nicely nonetheless. There's my vats. Wasn't a very successful vats run, but there you go. Oh, there we go. Whoa, this is just chaotic. I could handle this much better, but you know, this is how we're going to do it now. This is how things work now. Okay, we still have an active shooter. I'll take some loot here. Lovely, jubbly. Hmm. Oh! How are you all the way down there? I, I, I don't know, I just... I just have more success not using bats. That's a little disappointing. All right, we have time, we have time. Um. <laughs> oh, oh, look at you. You scared me. That sort of 
thirst a little. Hmm. Kind of regretting not cooking some meats. But there we go. That's not too shabby now at all. All right. So let's have a look at this terminal here. There's something to the left of it as well. Safety concerns, human resources director, industrials will not be liable for any injuries you may sustain while attempting to access the office. Right. Access to R&D will be require a key card. Uh, at this point forward, all employees will be required to sign non-disclosures. We run a tight ship here, any leaks, and we all sync together. All right, some archives. Come here, you can keep chipping away at your soul in exchange for a couple of pieces of silver. I love it. Kick to the curb, but those robotic scabs had families. Yes, yes, bit of an uprising here. Ooh, checkpointed. What's that? So, we've got that explorer down. Now we've got to search Penny's office. Oh, about Motherload, okay. p 4 your position. You haven't heard anything, have you, Penny? Okay. Penny's office. A car outside, assume everything was alright. Found mounted. Mr. Gutsy things patrolling our block. Da 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 da. There's the fighting going on at the dig site. Okay. Spreading like wildfire. So search Penny's office. We can do that. Quest started. The mother load. Kind of a mining quest. Cover the secret of the industrial mon mother load. I nearly said money load. It's fragmentation mine. I don't fancy the toxic water. Definitely take the lead pipe. Getting a little irradiated there again, and looks like we're going this way. No, that's out. Oh, these <laughs> these quest markers, they turn me around. I was just about to hit the button on the damn door too, and I just realized that's outside. I don't want to go outside. Penny's office is hardly outside. If you th Well, what do we know about Penny? Let's be realistic. Maybe her office is outside. But... Glad I decided it wasn't. Oh, I'll take... Yeah. I'll take that ammo right there. Be handy when this machete breaks. So far, so good. Sneaky Sneaky is in effect. And we are hidden. And yet, we are not alone. Oh boy, we are not alone. Oh, is that a super mutant? It is. It is a super mutant. Nice. Some more ammo. I feel like we're uh, building up to something here. True game style. Acquire skill one. All right, that's not for me. All righty. Take those. We got some bobby pens there as well. Moving on around. Ooh, a chemistry station. Let's uh, scrap our junk, I think. I lightened our load here a bit. We get rid of some of this stuff as well, I guess. That's not going to be much use to me. Got two hatchets. Let's get rid of the lower one. Two machetes. Got a load of pipe bulb action. Okay. Crafter scrap range weapon. That's another ten. So they both have damage 45. I'll keep the one I have. Yeah. Well, yeah, scrap it. No. Scrap this one. We're really lightening the load there now. Whoa. Okay, again, it's a gunfight. It's not going on with me, though. Or else they're just shooting into the room blindly. I don't know. <sighs> I'm not trying to place a camp. Oh, that's what L1 does. Okay. Yeah. 
Are they shooting the cockroaches? Right. Whoa. It's all these <laughs> all these noises are driving me nuts. Let's take some grenades there, thank you very much. What is going on? All this running, how many people are there? Uh, get up. I'm just not not understanding what's going on. <laughs> Oh, this is awesome. I don't I literally don't know what to do. Um Okay, we can we can pop this open. Eight bobby pins. Ah oh, what? They're much more fragile than they were in previous fallouts, I'll tell you that. Don't don't break. Thank you. Alright, some gunpowder and some other random junk. I'll take that, we'll pop him. Not much going on in this room either. Oh, we'll take those. Oh, I'm a sucker when it comes to ammo. It doesn't matter what kind of ammo it is. I'll take it. It's not even a question, it's just like auto pick it up. If they had a mode for auto pick up all ammo you come across, I would totally be enabling that. They're getting louder. They're not below me, so above me. Oh, look at that. Okay, they are. You see some dust come off the ceiling there when you hear that like loud running. So thereabouts. Let's close this up. Can we close? Add a false sense of security, so to speak. Hiring system terminal. All right, what do we got here? Other than it being hiring. Invalid credentials for the senior executive hiring exam. A resume. A resume. Oh. Nope. <clears throat> Invalid credentials. Okay, another room where I'm relatively safe here. Grab that fuse. You never know when you're going to need a fuse. Hmm. I love that I'm a paramedic with a party hat. <laughs> Post-apocalyptic world. Cigarettes. And... Is that... Yes. I didn't... Okay, this one didn't have an autoplay option. So, let's just uh, try and find it and pop it on there real quick. I presume you've seen to it that the technology support group has updated the senior executive exam with my clarified answers. I'm growing weary of the spineless executives you've been sending me. You find me some candidates with the wherewithal to survive here, or else I'll find someone who will. Clearly not a, a fan of their new hires. Hmm. It won't affect my review. But I need to make sure my mom and dad are alright. That's fair enough as far as reasons go. Alrighty. We haven't... Okay. We can climb here. We know they're right above me. I don't know how many, but it... Try and get a advantage on him. Maybe we'll drop down and say hi there in a second. Nope, that would just bring us outside. And we do not want that. Alright, both these doors are inaccessible, but there is something inside. Right, so they must be under me directly, because they're not at that side. But 
wonder do they hear me there? Of course it's out of order. All right, let's make our way down. Making my way downtown. Yep, no one near me. No one near me at all. Penny's office. Oh no, I pushed the button. Damn it. The intention was to clear the floors back up. I did not mean to push eggs. Oh, I hate it when that happens. I do hate it when that happens. Well, I'm going to leave it there for now. In the next video, we'll come right back in and find Penny's office. Thank you so much, as always, for tuning in. If you liked the video, please do hit that like button and like the video. If you're not a subscriber, consider a subscription. Until next time, take it easy. All the best.